Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 1114. Where we have 30 moves to collect 9 yellow candies. One, two, well this is 9, I know it's a 9 by 9 grid. It doesn't ever get any bigger than that, and it looks like it's the full length. So, these are our 9. Now where are they going to come out? Oh, uh, they just keep cycling back around. So, if I could just take out this cake bomb, these would all activate, in other words, turn yellow. And because they're all in a row, they would all collect each other. They would all just kind of match together. If I do things like make a color bomb and take out the green, um, then the green will turn yellow. And let's say I take out all but two through that method, then I might be in trouble because then I wouldn't have two to match. So I'm going to try to take this area out and see what I can do to hit this cake bomb. That's what I need to do. I'm going to keep track. This keeps cycling through. So that's going as I thought it would. Nice. I love when this gets taken out here. And I should look for concentrations of color. Ooh, how do I get this paired with this to hit this? Well, if I bring this down one and this comes round, I'd love to move it over too so it's squarely where I need it to be. That's not likely to happen, and this might not even stay where it's supposed to. Anything could happen when we have a conveyor belt. There it goes. Okay. Well, we'll just try something new. Now, this and this wouldn't work well together, but if I drop them onto the conveyor belt at the same time, that might work. What I should do is concentrate. Oop, no. Or that's going to happen. Concentrate on making... Here we go. Specials that can work together. Now I drop this down onto the conveyor and look at this. It's in perfect alignment to hit that cake bomb. These just keep filling with licorice, so that's kind of okay. I don't mind that. Now I just have to do that one more time. What color isn't very prevalent here that I could get rid of? Well, orange, but I don't have any way to get orange. Orange and blue. If I get rid of orange and blue, I will get some other things created. But now things have changed. There's been a lot of cycling. Uh-oh, look at that. So, let's drop this guy down a bit. I wonder... Could I possibly get these guys together to strike here? It wouldn't affect the lucky candies. Lucky candies don't turn into stripes, right? Who knows on the new platform, but that's how it always should be. Ooh, I can do this to strike that guy. I've got another color bomb. So if I take out a color, everything's going to concentrate into something spectacular. Oh wait, I'm going to do this. I've got one green settled here. I want more. Nine moves left. What if I took out all of something? If I took out all of something, these are likely to strike together. Hmm. I've got another green coming around. So I'll do this. Oh, and I've got a green here and here. Come on, go for it. There we go. So this should do it. This got taken out, but how in the world did that not turn? How in the world did that not turn? Drives me crazy when things like that happen. Really frustrating. Alright, let's see what we can do here. If I can take out this, I get these together. <sighs> Alright. We have to try it again. We have to figure out what went wrong and how to correct it. 
if I can just get all of that other stuff done more quickly, then I'll have time to take out the remnants. Don't know how those remnants happened. I can see where things might go off track because we take out all of these and they slide over, but I don't see how that red did not connect. So, a little frustrated. Can you tell? Ah. <laughs> uh. I think it's funny. Some people get upset with me when I beat it and there are no problems. And oh my goodness, look what just happened. When I beat it and there are no problems and everything goes well for me and I seem unflappable and then other people get mad at me when I get upset that things don't go right. Well, of course, we all want things to go our way, right? Uh, of course, I get upset. I could open that up. This is a whole different game now that we've got things in different orders here. So now I have to have a different technique. I only have two yellow over here, but if I have some yellow over here, so if I could just pop that purple and there are openings now where I could pop that purple, then I could match this up with the yellow and be done, right? So that would be another way to go about this. Wait for a reshuffle. Those ways to pop that purple are diminishing. Things are filling in, I think. All right, let's see. I'm not getting anywhere. I need to take out a color that, well, if I could take out purple right now, I just would. I would just collect that and then deal with the consequences. And it looks like I have to use this now. Oh, no, I've got one move. Huh. Come on, guys. Now I don't. If I take out all yellow, this is the stranded one. I don't like stranding one. I would rather take out a different color. Let's take out all blue from the board, concentrate things down, see if that changes things here for us. Oh, now I just separated those. See if this gives us an opportunity to make another color bomb. I don't think this is going to work. <laughs> oh, because even if I attempted to take out the cake bomb at this point in time, this would still end up just being yellow and not being collected. So, yeah, this one's pretty much done for, I think. Because I'm an optimist, I never give up until the last move, but yeah. That one's done for. All right, let's try one more time. We can do it. We can do it this time. <laughs> to the sounds of a cat wiping out behind us. All right. I still like that first strategy that I had if the board plays with us. As long as the board plays along and doesn't give us, ooh, look at that, a reshuffle. And it's very unlikely now that I've got a lot open and I've got this, then we should be okay. Now I do have to match this with something. That's okay, it's good to concentrate the colors. Actually, I don't have any blue. Do I match these or not? Because some got left behind before, so maybe it is a good idea to match some. I'm going to take out all red. There's only two red open there. That should still leave me with enough. And now I have to see what did this allow me to do? What kind of cool, crazy things can I do because I have very little red on the board? Well, now I've got a lot more red back on the board. But that seems to be okay. All right.
As a matter of fact, that's very okay if I can get this together before it explodes, and it may explode. I've got two red here. I don't have enough red over there. I don't like that yet. I've got one blue here, two blue here, one red, one red. Ah, uh, I'm going to go ahead. What about purple? Well, things are going to change with this next conveyor. I don't see the purple doing much better, and the blue is along the bottom. I'm going to go ahead and do this, see what we can manage. That's pretty good. Okay, so now I have a couple things here to take out. So if I can just do stripes and get them in position. How do I get them in position? Well, I take these and I drop them down, right? But I have to keep dropping them down. There we go. Hmm. Oh, I see how this can work. I can use these to strike this, and then I've got that one set up as well. There we go. All right, let's see what happens here. It got everything except this, but look what I've got now. I've got this, which is 9, and I can encourage it further. And um, I had 12 moves, so I just have to kind of play it safe here, make sure that this doesn't get taken out. Make little innocuous moves tiny little moves that aren't going to bother anybody until I can get my color bomb down there to match. Because when I get this all in a stream of at least five, I get a color bomb. So that's the technique that I would try over and over. It didn't work for me the first time around, and obviously the second time around had its own complications, and I wasn't able to recover from that. But you saw that the third time around, my initial instincts worked with a little modification at the end. If you'd like to see more videos, you can subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. And as always, thanks for watching.